Good morning, guys. So today is Friday, whatever date that is. Um, and I know I haven't picked you up. I think I didn't pick you up Thursday. But I was working really hard to make sure that I kind of move forward quicker with this um, two-piece pens and waistcoat combo. And I did move further along. And I want to show you how far Feather Alone is so that you kind of see what I've been working on. Um, so today I'll be joining everything together on the waistcoat and hopefully also on the, um, what's this, on the pens. The only thing that's left on the pens is the um, waistband that requires me to add some loops. <laughs> All right, let me turn you around. Turn, turn. This is what we are working with. That is our pants and waistcoat combo. And there are our um, little, um, what do you call this thing, swelled pockets. I need to finish them up, but that's how they are looking. That's the back of them. I also have this little detail over here on the pants. And then, oh, button gone. We have a full welt pocket at the back. That's that. Okay, friends, stand in one place. Yeah. Basically, that's that on that. I'm just going to go ahead and stitch everything that requires me to stitch on the waistcoat. Oh, also on the waistcoat. I didn't show you the little, um, those things. <laughs> I don't know what you call them. Yeah, those things at the back. I just need to finish up, man. I'm so tired of working on one garment for such a long time, but I guess that's what comes with working on anything that's tailored it's a lot of work all right catch you up in a bit once i am a bit further <laughs> with stitching hello beautiful people welcome or welcome back to my channel please continue liking sharing commenting and subscribing so today is monday and this is the last week before um, I received new students for my beginner course that's going to be over here in the studio. I am recording currently on my phone because unfortunately my camera is telling me it can't read my memory card. So that's not on that. It's a new thing. It's always really the memory cards, but today it's just uh, decided it's not going to work. So what I'm going to be doing is today, because one other thing that happened is this morning, I left the brown pants I was working on and the waistcoat at home, which means I'm not going to be able to finish those. And I wasn't going to be able to finish them anyway. Uh, because the number of buttons I have is not enough for both the pants and the um, waistcoat. So there's that. I have decided to start on a pair of pants and a skirt with the fabrics that I have in the studio currently um, that I'm also making for my sister as well. And I'm going to be propping you on my tripod which is giving me a bit of drama also we'll figure it out it's a messy day it's starting off messy but i know it's gonna work out great because we trust jesus on this platform so we are just going to trust him through this process and i'm gonna provide you content regardless so yeah let me prop you somewhere and start working on the, the pattern i think for the pants and then the dress, I think I'm going to freehand on the fabric itself. It's just a, a simple, what do, you, what do they call them? Is it like a sleep dress, skirt? I don't know. 
but you'll see the fabric it's black and that silky um, poly polyester silk type um, fabric so yeah <laughs> Guys, I think it finally agreed to work, so I just need to delete some of the footage that's in uh, the camera right now, and we're going to be on the camera. I'd rather like high quality videos and good audio. Um, I mean, my phone is still good, but this, I bought it because I wanted the quality to be top notch for you guys. So. Let me get rid of um, whatever content was still in here and then we are going to be on the camera. <sighs> so happy we are back in business. So we are on the camera right now and I'm excited. We are about to start working. We have 46 minutes on the memory card. Exciting times for us. Never mind the fan. I'm sure you've been hearing it in the background. It's pretty hot. So there's that. So this is my sister's um, little pattern that we did the brown pants with. I am going to modify it so that we do a very skinny, like close to the skin um type pant and oh a little fabric haul this is the fabric i was talking about for the skirt this black silky type uh fabric so i'm going to be making her a skirt out of this and the pants are going to be out of a white um what do you call this four-way stretch yeah i'm just gonna check also if i have some white invisible zips because because I want it to be super tight on the on the ankle so I need to insert some invisible zips there for that purpose for her leg to go in otherwise the other zip which is going to be on the waist I will wait on that one um, yeah because I don't have money <laughs> the girl is broke and my sister is actually texting me right now laughing about something anyway um let me um let me pause you for a second before i i begin i need to answer here <laughs> we need to save the memory <laughs> all right It's time to wake up. Child of the Most High, son or daughter of the King, it's time for you to wake up. God is calling you. He's calling you to do great things, but you cannot do that when you're asleep. Watching YouTube. Hi, welcome or welcome back to my Those who I watch. No, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Laura, and I'm a faith-based content creator. I make videos sharing all about my journey with God to encourage you on your journey with Him. So if that's something that you're interested in, now feel free to subscribe to become part of the family of the community that God has built on here, for which I am so extremely grateful. It's so good to have you here, fam. For everybody that's not new here and that knows me, how are you doing? How's your week been? Let me know. I've had a tough one.
guys so i am done cutting the pants and it seems like it's gonna be a pretty quick um, little project all i need to do right now is to pin the front and the back together and stitch so over here i have zips white ones a long one and a short one and this one is a bit on the cream side and this one is like pure stuck white and i feel like well it's invisible zips that are going to be down there on the legs so it's not gonna be that much of a big deal i'm gonna cut this one shorter and insert them there right now i just need to go ahead and pin my little um fronts and backs together and overlock yeah <laughs> i need to overlock and i'll be lying if I, I say i'm not hungry already i'm super hungry i didn't eat breakfast so i only packed my lunch we're not gonna eat lunch this early <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and keep on working pushing real quick so that um by the time i do actually feel the hunger i am further along so i need to finish the pants before um 12 and start the skirt cut it and what should i do should i cut the skirt already because the thing is with the fabric right it needs to hang so that it can uh, drop so let me know guys what do you think i should do should i go ahead and and cut the skirt already so that i can hang it on the mannequin to drop and then get back to the pants because both of the projects are pretty quick uh projects to do yeah i'm, I'm confused guys You'll just see in the next clip what I do because usually I just think about them like this and go ahead and do something else. So uh, you'll just see what I do next. <laughs> hey guys, so it's a bit late and it's actually 12. Yeah, one minute past 12 and i still hadn't finished um the pants like i had thought i would be done i had to put you guys down and um charge you because the battery was running low diago is in the studio back there <laughs> she's about to like fit her little pants she was working on last week and what i had done was while I was waiting for you guys to charge, I decided to clean the small machines, the um, overlocker and the... Um, what? Anyway, the Benina machines, yeah. <laughs> so, afterwards, I just overlocked. I'm gonna show you right now. Can I? So, here we are. I overlocked the side seams of the pants because remember we had an invisible zip down here so i pinned them together after overlooking such a great overlocker i'm not gonna lie the stitching is perfection um and i'm i've decided i'm not gonna add the zipper today i'm gonna go ahead and fit my sister first and once i love the fit of the pants i will insert the the zipper tomorrow but when i pick you back up again i'll be probably working on the skirt the black skirt we talked about earlier and then i can move back on to our pants because i do need to make sure that um the skirt is hanging by the mannequin dropping Alright, catch you up when I am done. Mm -hmm. 